Well, excitement in the air. We've all known about this date for a long time, and the stage is set in the Spanish capital for the UEFA Champions League final. Hello, everyone. I'm Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary, as always, on these big occasions by Lee Dixon, and we're approaching kickoff time here at the Estadio Metropolitano. It's Inter facing Milan. Well, thanks, Derek. Probably the biggest club competition in the world. The final at the end of that competition is always fully expected to be a great game but you've got a lot of players involved who are very nervous but I always look down as well Derek to the coaches what do they do on a night like this there's nothing they can do they can't kick a ball but they certainly can use their brains do they change their game plan do they have a special game plan for a final like this I suggest you've got here on merit just carry on doing what you do Champions League it's where everyone wants to be only two sides can accomplish that feat and Lee it's going to be fascinating to see what happens tonight well it is it's the big part here it will be after the game but as players it's very difficult to try and stay in the moment and not get carried away and that's the job of the senior players in the dressing room but also the coach look around your team see the calm ones have a word with them get them to pass the message on stick to the game plan go out and win the game There was definitely a need for a new Atletico Madrid stadium and they've got the new ground here in the eastern part of the capital, the Metropolitano, and it's brilliantly. It is. I was lucky enough to go to the Calderon. I love that stadium. Very old, as you said, and literally falling down. So they needed a new home and they've done a great job with this one. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. Inter's lineup is as follows. Wing backs are important in this setup. Did you enjoy your experience of playing at wing? And a chance for them to nudge in front. Really digging in at the back, but still the opportunity. The shot wasn't really far enough away from the goalkeeper, was it? No, but he picked up the flight nice and early. Salamakos has it. And do they mean business on this occasion? Delivered into the area here. Well, he's given a corner, their referee. And firing it into the area. No nonsense clearance. Rebic. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Kessier. Now Dzeko. Now Brozovic. Inter have given away possession. Ibrahimovic. the same it'll be a corner corner kick played in well, it didn't have to be a 10 out of 10 from the keeper, but high marks anyway. Seven and a half, I'm going to give him for that one. Seven and a half, well done. It's with Florenzi. Yassine Adli. Ibrahimovic. Rebic. And Kessier. 
Will there be a tangible end product? The goalkeeper relatively untroubled. Yeah, he's not, he's not going to let that one in, Derek. Chalanoru. Varela has it. Matteo Damian. And it's Ibrahimovic finding a forward gear. Can he produce? And Skull for the cross. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Now Brozovic. Ivan Perisic. It's with Chalanolu. And now De Frey. Dzeko. Barella has it. Yassine Adli. Dzeko. Now, what can he do here? Whatever it takes to keep them out. An attempt like that, never likely to trouble the keeper. No, he's got his positioning right, but it was a poor shot in the end. It is a decent-looking attack here. Targets available, cross comes in. Well, thumped clear. And a throw-in forthcoming. Brozovic, it's with Chalanolu. And cleared away. And now De Frey. Varela has it. Brozovic, Ivan Perisic. He just keeps going, no let up. And it has arrived, the opening statement in this UEFA Champions League final. Well, so often than not, the post can be the goal his friend. Not on this occasion. So close, but it's in. Well, let's have another view of that goal. And back playing here with Inter, the team holding the advantage. Yassine Adli. Now Dzeko. Given away by Inter. Given away by Milan. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. Brozovic. Barella has it. Half-time then, and we're sorry for the pause in the proceedings here, Lee, because this has been a thoroughly riveting Champions League final so far. Well, it has. Great game. Sometimes finals can be cagey affairs, but not this one. Let's hope Derek in the second half we get more of that. It's been really, really entertaining. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Kessier has it. Adley has it. It's with Chalanolu. On the ball, Bastoni. Brozovic. Barella has it. Now Brozovic, he has teammates to play it to. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. He made it look simple, really. Remic, Yassine Adli. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, Derek, you're right, he has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. Kessier. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Yassine Adli. 
And options in the centre. Effective challenge. It's with Chalanolu. Ivan Perisic. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Is he going to punish them here? And now Perisic. And he's pulled it back here. Terrific block there. Damian. And now De Frey. Chalanolu. Now Brozovic. It's with Chalanolu. Varela has it. The emphasis is on passing the ball forward. Now, what can they do from here? Ante Rebic has it. It's with Ibrahimovic. It's with Romagnoli. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. It's with Chalanolu. They couldn't maintain possession. Brozovic. It's with Stefan de Frey. It's with Chalanolu. Will there be a tangible end product? And Perisic prepared to fire. Corner kick awarded. And let's see if this will help them add to the lead. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. He's driven in the corner. Can they slot it home? He's very adept at protecting the ball. Varela has it. And the goal kick is the outcome. And a substitution in the offing. Varela has it. Now here's Arturo Vidal. Carrying a genuine threat here. Arturo Vidal. Will he play it in? And Dzeko's in there. Betwixt and between that clearance. It's with Lorenzi. Strong play here on the shielding front. Skriniar. Chalanolu. Now here's Arturo Vidal. Benassa. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Full time and the issue has been settled. One team crestfallen, the other jubilantly. Well, there's winners and there's always losers. Fine margins between the two. Expectation wins nothing, Derek. Got to go out there and seize the moment. And for these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, you have to enjoy it because it passes so quickly. the presentation of the cup with the big ears well you just think how many games he played this season as well all that's in the past now the game that's just happened was the most important one they're all poised the Champions League winners in 2019 can feel the emotion.
is natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. The cup with the big ears, as it's affectionately known. And this is the moment, Derek, sharing it with the supporters to get a chance to take it a little bit closer to those stands. Let them enjoy the experience with you. And the families are up there in the stands as well. A brilliant occasion. It took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Necessary qualities. Now the chance for a photograph. My mum always told me to get on the front row. She taught you well, Lee. There we have it. The Champions League victors for 2019.